I'm a seventh grader. Let's go ahead and get this homework out of the way. I'm going to do number six, which means I have the even ones. Starts off with water boils at lower temperature as elevation increases. Okay, so that tells me uh, the higher my elevation, right, the quicker my water is going to boil, right? Water boils at lower temperature as elevation increases. Okay, Rob and Ann live in different cities. They both boil the same amount of water in the same size pan and repeat the experiment the same number of times. Each records the water temperature just as the water starts to boil. Use box plots to display their data. Compare the medians of the box plots. If I compare these, I start noticing that this is 205 or 206, and this is 207 here. And there's one, two, three, four, five spots in between, which means every one of these represents two or, or point two, because this is 206 and 207. That's one away. So if we break these up into 10, this each half one will be point one. Now I see over here, Rob's is lined up right here, right? And Ann's is lined up right here. Okay, which means Rob's is 0.1 lower, okay? The median of Rob's data is 0.1 lower. The median of da Anna's or Ann's data. Now it says uh, the me this means that Rob is at blank elevation than Anna. Well, if it says the water boils at lower temperature as elevation increases, okay? So that means uh, if Anna is taking longer, to, uh, let's see, this is degrees in Fahrenheit. So if hers is boiling at a higher degree, it starts boiling at a higher degree and water boils at lower temperature as elevation increases, and since his is at a lower temperature, that means Rob is at a higher elevation, okay? So uh, Rob is at a higher elevation, okay? And uh, I really should have remembered to put Fahrenheit here. I do want to get into practice of labeling everything correctly. So this would be Fahrenheit degrees Fahrenheit, okay? So 0 0.1 degrees Fahrenheit lower than the medium of ants. Uh, let's move on to number, well, you got number seven to do. I'm gonna do number eight. It said the box plot shows the height of a sample of two types of trees, okay? Tree number one and tree number two. The median height of tree uh, blank is greater. Well, the median height of tree number one obviously is greater because Tree number one is sitting about right here, which would probably be about 28, right? If this is going to be five in between, I would say this is about 28. And this one over here for tree two is only at about maybe 17, right? So uh, we're going to say tree one is greater. All right, uh, number nine is yours to do, which means I have number 10, higher order thinking question. The box plot shows the Daily average high temperature of two cities from January to December, their city X and city Y. Which city should you live in if you want a greater variability in temperature? Variability. Okay. Well, we see that both of them have, uh, let's see, city X has a medium of about, well, if this is 35, this would be about 37, right? And then we have uh, city Y, which is sitting at, 40, but that's not what they're asking. They're asking about the variability, and that would mean that I'm going to count that quartile, right? So let's first look at the range. The range is always the biggest number minus the small number, uh, smallest, and that's going to make uh, 60 minus 10. And that gives us a range of 50. We change our check city Y, we see we also have 60 minus 10, which will make our range the same. Sorry, this should have been 
50, not 5. Okay. So now we have to look at the inner quartile range. And that would be 50 minus 30 here. And that's going to equal 20. But on city Y, we have 50 minus 25. So the inner quartile range for city Y is going to be greater. So I can say that having a little problem dragging this down. There we go. The range and temperature for the city is the same. So we compare the interquartile ranges. If interquartile range or the interquartile range for city X is 50 minus 30, as we said here, and the interquartile range for city Y is 50 minus 25, as we said here, because 25 is bigger than 20, city Y has a more has more variability and temperature. And that's doing homework and record time, people. All right, good luck on the couple that you had to do. See you in class for grading. Have a good night.